A son of a Hezbollah commander, he was killed just like his father. Jihad Muhaine came into the public eye when he was just 16, at his father Imad's funeral, after the top Hezbollah commander was assassinated in a 2008 car bombing. Before the mourners, he vowed to take up the cause of the Shiite group. In your name, my father, I tell the martyrs and the leaders of Hezbollah, we are with you, we are your sons, we take your path and won't leave the cause, leave the fields or the weapons. On Sunday, on the Syrian side of the Golan Heights, Jihad Muhaine was among six Hezbollah fighters killed after an Israeli airstrike. Among the victims, Commander Abu Isa and an Iranian national. Israel hasn't commented on the helicopter strike, but they have confirmed it. Some see the attack as a response to the head of Hezbollah, who said on Thursday that the group would retaliate against Israel for repeated strikes in Syria. An eye for an eye scenario that's happened before. Hezbollah and Israel are sworn enemies and fought a deadly war in 2006. But since then, they've largely shied away from direct confrontation. Even if Israel has struck Syria several times since the start of the war there, they say the strikes are part of a vow to intercept weapons headed for Hezbollah.